Hello, I'm Chuck Phillip with South Alabama Home Inspections and welcome to another edition of Southern Home Talk. I'm standing beside a grinder pump system which uh, many houses have in a lot of these newer subdivisions. And the way this works is that whenever you flush the toilets or even run any the draining inside the home, it actually comes down to this sump which has a pump in there and it grinds it up and pumps it out to the street. And this is the control box for it right here. And this opens up by these latches here on the side. And this is what it looks like on the inside. And this is the instructions that you should follow if you connect this to a generator. And you know we do have storms where the power goes out and you won't be able to pump this uh, sump out if you don't have power to it. And that's what it has right here on the side. That's the, the plug-in connection from a generator. So it's gonna take 240 volts you know, to energize this system. And so um, this is gonna be the date it was installed. 11921 and in this case usually they have a label here on the front that tells you who the service provider is uh, but here is uh, this one's actually serviced by Baldwin County sewer system and here is a list of the things that they don't want you putting in the system you can freeze frame this if you want to uh, kind of see what it all all this on this list and of course there's going to be the contact information on the bottom of the of this pamphlet and if you introduce any of this stuff into the system, it can damage the pump, and it costs about $2,500 to replace these, you know, plus you're going to have a, a service call, and who knows how long it may take for them to get out there uh, to fix your pump. And also, you don't want this lid to get down below grade either, because uh, sand from the topsoil uh, can get in there and damage the pump as well. And so, you know, this does require some, some maintenance in order to keep it uh, functioning properly. And so they also have uh, this light up here at the very top. And so if you see that flashing or steadily on, that could indicate there's a problem with the system. Uh, so just know this briefly about uh, this type of system. And I also have another episode on this channel that goes into more detail if you want to take a look at it. But I figured I'd make a brief one uh, just so you can kind of sort of see what this looks like up close. Uh, thanks for watching, guys.